All right, here we are. Crank in the head. San Martino giving the WWE Universe the opportunity to appreciate a true legend and an impactful display of Whoa, okay. <laughs> no, bro. Are you serious? Kick out just before two. Unbelievable display of will in the late stages of this matchup. Bro, they made Hulk Hogan look huge. Come on, ref. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Damn. I was trying to sit there and pick up the uh, uh what you might call Yeah, but Oh, another rival I would have wanted to sit there and see is uh, John Cena and Big Show. But again, we can't sit there and get that because um, they left on bad terms. Or even John Cena and Carlito. That would have been that would have been nice, honestly. Because I think that was like, ah, uh, never mind. I was gonna sit there and say that was John Cena's like first real rivalry. As like a baby face, but or even GBL. Dang, come on, man. Like, Grant, like I'm not sitting there saying you got you have to put everybody in there, but some of these people like ha had some really iconic uh, moments with John Cena. Um, can he pick that up? Oh my goodness. Oh, okay, never mind. He can. Hey, that's John Cena's weapon of choice. And you know, honestly, man, when I was playing the uh the battle in the cell, if you know, you know. Oh no, put it up. Set it up. I mean. Um, I forgot to sit there and say this, but uh I honestly think um like Randy Orton was also a big um Still steps guy, too. Mm. <laughs> Bro, you know the crowd would have went crazy if John Cena did that. That's not going to work. Uh, I thought I reversed that. Bro, he, John Cena instantly got up in that. But the grueling nature of this match is definitely getting to them now. No way! Mm, John Cena's face completely hit the um. Bruno beats him to the punch. Uh oh, not Stone Cold being the first one eliminated. Oh no, he's about to hit me with the stunner and eliminate me. Oh, never mind. No, oh, my goodness, that's even worse. <laughs> what a punch. What that was just a punch, bro. Why y'all over here over exaggerating that? Mm. Stone Cold, I didn't want to have to eliminate you first, but mm, I gotta do what I gotta do. Wait. Wait, wait a second. Ah, oh, I was gonna see if he had that um the lightning fist. Hold on. No, he turned the target on by himself. I didn't do that. Take this racist. One, two, and of course he kicked out. No, okay, I meant to change my target. Nah, but one thing I will sit there and say, um, we definitely shouldn't, um, oh, not them tag teaming me, pause. But we definitely should be willing to, no, bro. Oh, 
<laughs> Didn't have to use resilience. But yeah, one thing I will sit there and say is we do also gotta learn to uh, forgive. Cause like, let's sit there and be honest, none of us are perfect. And I'm pretty sure a lot of other people sat there and said some pretty bad things about other people or other races or anything in their lifetime. Like you're not gonna sit there and tell me you never sat there and said anything bad about anybody or sit there saying anything like, oh, I'm so glad that was my son. Or saying anything that wasn't like racist or something like that. You're not gonna sit there and tell me that. Even if it would have just been something out of, like pure ignorance. Bro, no, don't make him tap. Oh, okay, I wish I would have known he was gonna get out of that like that. Oh wait, never mind. I still got my uh, stamina and all that. Oh my goodness. Row break. Rip. <laughs> I said a mixture between ref and rope. Rope. I mean ref. Bro, how, man? Like, why was it moving so fast, bro? All this dude did was, like, hold me. And how is that not a rope break either? Break it up, stoner. I mean, <laughs> stone cold. Oh, okay, he fought out of it. Oh, okay, he can't grab anyone. No. Not him flipping me off. Dang, I tried to throw him through the uh, March McCall. Come on. Okay. Bro, come on, man. Like, why was it moving so fast? Pause. Yeah, but that's one thing I would sit there and say um, with um, Hulk Hogan. I like like, because, like, the good thing is he apologized. He could have sat there and not have apologized. And, like, we do know that, like, his character hasn't been one of honesty, you know, with all the lies and stuff he sat there and made up over his career and all the people who screwed over. But at the same time, it's like, you got to be willing to sit there and forgive. Because, like, why would you sit there and hold a grudge? about this dude when it's been years, you know? Because honestly, I can't even remember when it happened. I th no, actually, I think it happened in 2014. Oh, I thought he was going to the second. Mm. But yeah, that's how I sit there and see it. All right. I'm not going to lie, from that angle, it did kind of look like a spear instead of the single leg takedown. Uh, of course. 
No, but I will sit there and say John Cena was in facts um, when he was talking about how you come back from um, certain issues or whatever. Because um, I, I know y'all used to remember when I sat there and played WWE 2K17, and I used to be horrible. But like, even though I was horrible, and you know, I would only win when like people would purposely get themselves counted out and stuff like that. Um, one thing I couldn't sit there and say is I did get better pretty fast. And once I got better, I just kept going, kept going, kept going, getting better and better and better. Even when I would sit there and lose in crazy situations, I found ways to sit there and, um, like, what's it called? Yeah, but it was just like one of those things. It's just pretty much my point is just, yeah, like Johnson says, never give up. Just keep trying. Like, if you sit there and you work hard to try and really get to where you want to be, um, sit there and just keep working hard. Find ways to sit there and work smart. And then sit there and see what people are doing that are successful in your feed <laughs> I mean in your field is what I meant to say and then like work on it like that mm. <laughs> another one where DJ Khaled at Yeah, I try to jump out. Mm. Bro, they just got both of them just sitting right here. I really hope we get these desks at discount. Oh, I thought he was gonna throw me on the steps. But yeah, that's just one thing that you gotta sit there and do to be successful. Or to even like just sit there and grow. And that's why, like, a lot of people uh, don't understand. Damn. Uh oh. 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 Come on. Boom, let's go. Come on, ref. Come on, we got this. You can't see me. Come on, the same move he beat me with so many times. Let's go. Oh, come on. Come get us. Come get us, Stone Cold. You can't see me. <laughs> why was why was um Stone Cold, I mean, Hulk Hogan running away from Stone Cold. Well, walking away from Stone Cold. And he's doing the peace signs with this. When did Cena start doing the peace signs? I feel like they forgot to animate it, to be honest. Bro, not Hulk Hogan throwing in Stone Cold to get rid of him. He's like, that's not going to work for me, brother. Beat him up for me, brother. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. Oh, so they could, you could reverse it right there. I didn't know you could because at first, like, the last time it didn't pop up. Mm. Come on. 
dramatics. Probably one of the closest two and nine. Okay. Don't. Okay. All right. He's rolling out. Yes, that's what I was hoping for. Come on. Boom. Because I wanted Stone Cold to use his whatchamacallit. Oh. He didn't even have to use his whatchamacallit. Ooh. Yeah, I just got my head taken off. Mm, there we go. I'm glad he couldn't grab me out of the air. I wish it was like 2K19 where you could still like press circle even when they're switching positions. Boom! <laughs> Bro, Stone Cold mad. No! Ooh, that was so close. <laughs> Wrong person. Well, no, I meant to hit Stone Cold, but... He did the elbow drop. And another brutal attack on Cena. Cena came looking for a fight tonight, and boy, did he get one. He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. Crank in the head. Continues the attack on the I like how like the, like their stuff having their like puns in there. And like them getting eliminated. Mm, mm, mm. Ow. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. Oh, they couldn't put WrestleMania chairs for the people on the floor seats? Oh, maybe they might have it. He's heading back to the ring. The adrenaline is pumping and the WWE Universe. Come on. No. Bro, that could have been so bad. Stone Cold almost hit me with it. All right, bro. I'm about to grab a chair and just start swinging at everybody. No, wait, I can't. Not yet. Mm -hmm. Cut him off, bro. I should have let him hit, hit him with it. Oh, he didn't lose his finisher. Stone Cold, I literally saved you. What blood you see on the face of Cena? Come on, come on, let's go. I thought he was going to spin him around, but it's all right. Let's go. Come on. Get him out of there. One, two, three. And the game was right. He was stunned. All right, let's pump up them kicks. Come on, throwing up the peace signs. The champ is here. Bro, what is Michael Cole hating for? Mm, sit down. Come on, reverse him. No. Uh-oh. Let's go. Dang it, I forgot. Hogan might have just ended this one. Cover. There's two. Get off me. You can never say that John Cena doesn't bring everything. Yeah, I was not going to try to kick out of it. Fight. Case in point right there. And look at Hogan. Never in a million years did the Hulkster expect him to kick out after that. Yeah. 
he was like, that's not going to work for me, brother. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, as long as you're not prone in the middle of the ring. Mmm! No, he missed! Don't pin me. Let's go. Yeah, that's right. Pick that up. Try hitting me while I'm on the ground. And he finds an answer for the holster. Are you okay? Uh, hook. Don't be a submission. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. Hard to watch too. Come on. Uh oh. What a counter. And Cena puts a. <laughs> Bro, he put everything behind that one. Cena's never give up attitude shining through. Bro, quit missing your attacks, bro. Do not. <laughs> do not. Bro, don't. Don't do this. Don't. Don't hit me. I told you not to hit me. Come on, let's go. Yes, Fisherman. Boom. No. Yes! 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 Come on. Mm. Pick the... Okay. Don't pick the still steps up. Come on. Come on, ref. He's like, that's not going to work for me, brother. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can't see me. Hold on, does he have move thief? Oh. Oh, okay, so his signature STF. Oh, we don't have paybacks. Into the corner now. Here it is. I'm not going to lie. I thought he was going to kick out. <laughs> I am not going to lie. Bro, that was crazy. No, honestly, we do need some more um, fail for away elimination matches like that. You see that? Right when I think nothing can surprise me in this business, I find myself in the ring with three of the WWE's biggest legends. Bruno San Martino dominated the 60s and 70s. His two reigns as WWE champion combined for nearly 13 years. Hulkamania? Ran wild during the 80s, mm -hmm. headlining WrestleManias and clocking his own WWE Championship reign of four years. Stone Cold Steve Austin reigned supreme at the height of one of the WWE's most infamous eras, the Attitude Era. His victory <laughs> I like how the Ryan was wearing the Stone Cold vest. Propelled him into the stratosphere of superstardom. 
and then he came back and defeated Kevin Owens at WrestleMania last year. Legends. All of them. <laughs> All time. <laughs> that's what they said. Yeah, that's quite an honor. I'm thankful to even be considered to be in the same category, to be mentioned with the same prestige as them. These were defining moments in my career. These were the moments where I had to regroup, pick myself up, and find a way to come back better than before. Like I said, it's easy to keep going when things are going your way. But the times when you're down, when everyone thinks you're out, and you manage to rebound, you manage to show exactly what you're made of, these are the times when we learn who we are, what drives us, and we learn that as long as we keep our head in the game, there is nothing that can stop you from achieving anything you put in your sights. I hope we all learn something here. It's okay to lose. It's okay to fall short. What's unacceptable at all times is giving up. At any point, after any one of these matches, I could have packed it in. We don't do that in the C Nation. We hustle, we show loyalty, we earn respect, we never give up. Thanks for playing the WWE 2K23 Showcase. And until our paths meet again, I'll see you soon. Do I earn a trophy respect? All right, I know last time I was reading it and I like cut myself off by clicking on it. And I was going to sit there and I was thinking about it, but I think Big Show and Bray Wyatt, because those are two that I said that I think should have been on here. I think um, John Cena beat both those two. That's probably why they're not on here. No, he beat him in the Firehouse Funhouse match. Now, I remember that, that when Johnson came out to the NWO thing. That was crazy. The face that runs the showcase. Bro, that's such a star-studded, like, WrestleMania main event. I didn't see that coming. Yeah, but now this one was interesting. Just instant um, attitude adjustment, B2. But yeah, let me know y'all want me to play My Rise. Um, I've been trying to create more new wrestlers, you know. You know how I do it. Um, yeah, still. Ooh. And I'm glad they brought back tonight's match. Mm. But this would be definitely be pretty interesting to do them. And I think that was another thing that kind of helped me get better too when I just kept playing those matches or whatever. But, yeah. Um, creator safe mode. I don't know what that means by that. But I thought this was... Oh, that's just... Oh, wait. Yes, turn that on. Bro, this might be another... Okay, so I didn't realize... So that means the copyright music was on there. Mm. Well, now I know. Roster. Statistics. Power management, other teams, whatever gameplay. Legend. Was I gonna go? Oh yeah, jukebox. Cause I'm trying to sit there and see. Oh, I can't play the songs anymore, so I guess it doesn't matter. But yeah, I'm just trying to sit there and see the people I unlocked. And for those of y'all who don't know, I did get the deluxe um, edition. And. 
Yeah, I kind of messed with my gun. Mine was really cool. Yeah, rest in peace, Omaga. Yeah, but, um... That's crazy. Some of these female wrestlers, I just have no idea who they are. Like, I remember Stacey Keebler. But, like, her? I don't know who that is. Oh, Tamina looks different there. That's T-Bar? That looks like Kurt Hawkins. Yeah, I got her. I don't know. I know who that is. Sean Benjamin. They should have gave, got him his, ain't no stopping me now. Here comes the money. Oh, electrifying. I wish they had the um, one with uh, the dude who does the worm, Scotty Too Hotty. That would have been interesting. Yeah. Oh, is that Zelina Vega? <laughs> Nikki Cross. No, I put on the stalks that. I can at least stand to listen to. I think that's listen missing two letters. Ooh, pourquoi? I forget he, him and um uh Carl Anderson are in this hurricane. Interesting. I remember when he was Eli Drake. I used to love him when he like when he would go, dummy, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bro, that was hilarious. Dang, only if they had the slow chemical theme. Bro, all the John Cena thing. I like how these were just automatically like pressed, but you have to go and find this. It's like, bro, he had the same thing for I don't know how long. You don't need all these John Cena's. Bro, I didn't even see these three over here. I only saw these four. Bro, okay, yeah, no, we gotta sit there and take it off because we're gonna be hearing John Cena's song all the time. Yeah, and I did see you at Super Cena too. So no, we're not about to sit there and do all that. In the... Bro, that's so wild. Like, they had another one. It's like, bro, why so many John Cena's with the, his theme song on, like, on the preset? Oh, JBL is in here. Oh, no, they must have been DLC, because I don't remember them being in the game like that. Farouk. It's just Eddie Guerrero theme. What even, like, I forget. Because I'm trying to think, because I know there's, uh... Yeah, there's Viva La Raza. But that's 97. I don't know what his 97 theme was. I was hoping they had, like, Viva La Raza and then the one where it says Gangsta Lean. He looks familiar. Next big thing. Oh yeah, because that was two different versions of the song. Booker T. 
Nah, I'm not gonna lie with him with that little like ponytail is hilarious. Ooh, Beth Phoenix. I forgot her theme song. Boogeyman. Oh, so he must have been DLC too. I don't know why I was taking so long to do that. Booker T. I want to hear that theme song now. <laughs> Bro, this dude look like a Power Ranger. A Town Down. Yeah, but, um. I thank you guys for watching those of you who did. Please comment, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll definitely see you guys next time. And I might um, catch you on, um, well, y'all might catch me on, um, on um, tonight's match one of these days. Um, and like I said before, let me know if y'all want me to do my rise, because I can also sit there and do that. And so far, I think I made three characters. Um, I need to work on two of their moveset, and then I got to make some more wrestlers. Um, if y'all want to help me out with that, where I could just go ahead and download them, feel free to just go and make the characters um, and, like, post them on there but like sit there and you know put me as the credit because i you know created that character before but yeah so you can sit there make them and if i really like them i might sit there and download them or if i'm not gonna get around to making them then i'll download them but yeah but yeah like i don't know if y'all remember the 2k17 when i was making every single body bro even like characters that weren't even wrestlers that i wanted to like make i'm uh, making them in there but yeah until next time remember jay's up l's down bye oh yeah and please kind of like and subscribe if you haven't already